and probably in the future. Baba has a lot of friends and supporters all over this country. We want you to know that we take note of the steps that you've taken to galvanize support so that he can be elected the chair of the African Union Commission. Baba was also a very good friend of this family. For those of you who have gone through uh, that uh, nice publication in terms of his geology, can already see that. And I know he would have loved himself to be here by his side during this final journey that he takes. And I know that he stood by Baba's ideals. And so on behalf of Jacob, on behalf of Baba, family of Dr. Henry Shakava, please know that he has you in his heart during this difficult period. Now that we are here, one is to thank you for the olive branch that your government has issued to the doctors of our beloved country, Kenya. I hope that they get to sit on the table. But my ask of you, Your Excellency, is that please listen to the doctors, the young doctors of our beloved country, Kenya. We know that health is devolved, but the training component remains with the national government. The government gets to, you know, license the medical schools. They also get to admit the students and to pay, uh, you know, um, for their training. Really, we should have thought about their internship because that marks the end of their training. Without internship, they cannot be licensed to practice. Now, when we allow them to go for internship, they can then be licensed, and these guys can work anywhere in the world. And the private sector, I think, is also really waiting to receive them.